Hello guys! Welcome to our YouTube channel. It's your girl, Laika Marie, from BS Criminology 3A. At kung bago pa lang sa aming YouTube channel, please like, share, and subscribe for more updates. And for today's video, tatalakay natin ang buhay ni Jose Protasio Rizal Mercado E. Alonso Rialonda o mas kilalang si Dr. Jose Rizal. Without further ado, let's go started! Tropical sketches of Jose Rizal in this part of the readings, the life and education of Jose Rizal were discussed. At his young age, he had experienced an inferiority complex but he overcame his insecurities and rose. With the help of his supportive family, he was able to have the quality education and showcase his talents and intelligence. In pragmatic education, Rizal's limited allowance in his desire to learn more about eye elements practice in retinal cases because of his mother who suffered from failing eyelid, eye, failing eyesight rather, inspired and motivated him to study and practice eye surgery. He worked hard and expanded his exam, specialization in the treatment of eye diseases. And in troubles, frustration and disappointment, he self felt joy and sadness when he returned home. He was happy because he could finally be family and help his community by providing free medicine, medical consultations to the poor but he was also frustrated and disappointed because he received death threats and unable to see Leonora Rivera during the stay in the Philippines. Rizal received a lot of threats and criticism but his Masonic fraternity brothers were able to blunt the dangers direct, directed at him by was forced to live in his own country because of the threat. This could prevent the friars from kidnapping or assassinating Rizal. This is devastating to a person who is being sent away just because of aligned attempts to the Catholicized and so denationalized the Filipinos. Injustice and death. At the age of 35 years old, Dr. Jose ideas spread throughout Filipino intellectual life and how well-versed in them Filipino intellectuals were, Rizal instilled in us the necessity to oppose the aggressive way, regressive way rather, of thinking and living that existed in the Philippines under Spanish rule. The death of Rizal was remarkable. He mean much more to the Filipinos. It's part of evolution in the country against the Spaniard government. The life lesson that I learned in this topic that I have to spend so much of my time in self-improvement. So I don't have to be a actor or be a genius or lead any kind of glamorous existence in order to own representation. My values, hard work, and personal ethics plays an important part in my group. I'll be proud and more responsible of it.